Hello Capricorn, how you doing? Let's see what energies and messages we have for you today concerning your love. This person you're thinking about, this person who you can't seem to break an emotional connection with, walk away from whichever way. Let's see what energies and messages we have. Two of Cups, nice energy to start with. Some, some of you could be dealing with a soulmate. Mm. There's isolation, separation. You feel lonely either way. A lot of conflict, two fives. Two fives to me is ten, and before you laugh, ten in the major arcana is the wheel of fortune. That's things changing. This connection going off in a new direction. There's yes, there's misunderstandings here, there's a feeling of loneliness, there's worry, there's anxiety, there's conflict. But there is change. Ace of Cups. An offer of new love here. Major, major decision. The Judgment card. This is also about resurrection. It's, it's coming back to your old self. Finally healing. Finally getting over it. Finally laying things to rest. Breakthrough, sun card, beautiful energy in the near future. As I said, this is a passing phase. You're coming into much more abundant times. New healing, new growth. I feel for some of you, this is a this is somebody new in your life. For others, this is an old connection. But the chance to put things right. There could be some children involved here. Page of Wands, but I feel you see you, you're turning your back on this conflict. You want to walk away from it. Oh, they're proud. King of Pentacles, Taurus Burger, Capricorn energy. You could could be dealing with another earth sign. They're a little bit set in their ways. They like materialistic things. There can be a little bit of arrogance and, you know, it's kind of my way or the highway. In work, they're kind of high status, managerial, landowner, property owner, whatever it is they do, there's, it's kind of a high status thing. There's big changes though. Something here is ending. Something new is coming in. Magician, wow. I've done three readings this morning and that's popped up in all three of them. So there's communication here opening up. Life lesson learned, moving on. Very, very differently. This death card, you know, it's all about transit and purification though as well. It's it's Scorpio energy. But I feel here there's a situation that needed to end is ending and so it's allowing new new things to come in. Wow, there's a lot of emotion in this connection. As I say, there's 
there's some pride as well. Could even to be the, even be to the point a little bit of arrogance. Yeah, I'm feeling alone. Worry. Self-isolating in these times of COVID, that doesn't surprise me if you're physically self-isolating. But as this phase of worry and anxiety and feeling lonely, it's, it's kind of a life learning lesson here. And you're adapting. You're starting to follow your own guidance, which isn't a bad thing. Yeah, it's the changes of foot, you see. Wheel of Fortune. You always felt you're in competition with somebody all the time. I'm getting a competitive atmosphere here as well. Yeah, there's definite love there, but it did it, boy, did it cause some stress. It still is. Nine of Swords. I'm picking up forgiveness as well. Yeah. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. The person who you're dealing with, they, they could be a bit flighty, you know. Unpredictable. I feel here there's a there's an unprecedented decision here, major decision, and it taking place very very quickly. Kind of like you suddenly deciding to take a break from everything and go and spend some time alone, away from everything, so you can think. But I'm getting kind of yeah, an unpredictable. This person could come banging on the door after a, a long period of silence. And because there is a breakthrough here, but mm, there's trepidation as well. There's still some thoughts of the past. There's quite a history here. And as I say, there's, there's forgiveness. Big emotional journey. New beginnings, clarification, focus. See, as I said, you're adapting, you're learning to follow your own guidance. You are finding direction. Six of Swords. This person, as I said, they could even make a a sudden decision to come and see you. Out of the blue, there is travel here. They're moving on to a fresh start. You could well go to see this person or they come to see you and mm, I'm getting leaving a situation third party three of cups third party and reunions they could well be in a connection and leaving it that's not suiting them Take this out, it resonates. It is a general reading. I do see sudden news coming in, an opportunity, an invite, communication opening up very, very quickly. Sudden decision, this Knight of Swords coming in out of the blue. Wow. Suddenly open up. 
Somebody here is following their heart's desire. Spilling the beans. Yeah. Finally open up and I can see a conversation about this connection. An emotional conversation here. Yeah, some see so even at the bottom of the deck there's a decision on here on there's a heartfelt decision here, an emotional decision and a heartbreaking decision. As I say, take this out. It's a general read, so this could be you to them or them to you, but somebody is in a situation that they're walking away from and I can see a conversation taking place out of the blue. Unexpected travel to sort this out once and for all. I hope that's helped. And I hope to see you again soon. Bye for now.